Hello, Smart Bay community. I'm welcoming you in Smart Bay Talks, where we're discussing exciting and trending topics with software testing experts. And today we have a special guest, one of our available Ready API contributors, Prathap. How are you, Prathap? How are you today? I'm good. How are you? <laughs> great, great. That's great. Uh, Prathap, I'm sure that all of you saw valuable replies that Prathap posted practically each day to the Ready API community, and you followed the suggestions and solutions that he posted. Uh, thanks to this great activity, Prathap earned a community leader status for the first time last quarter, and it's a great activity and it's a great contribution in the community. Thank you. First of all, I'd like to congratulate you one more time for earning this great elite community status. And uh, now the community wants to learn more about you. So please share with us, uh, where are you from? What do you do? Which MindBear product do you use? Hi, community. And, uh, all, uh, hope everyone doing good and safe. I'm uh, basically from India. Uh, now I'm in the United States uh, working as an uh, automation uh, engineer, I'm working uh, with UPS as a, a consultant in automation uh, from last uh, one year. So I started my career uh, as a automation tester, a uh, little bit of manual testing as well when I started. Uh, after that, I moved to uh, complete automation. So uh, from last five years, I'm working on automation testing, both UI and that, you know, API as well. Also, I'm uh, involved in uh, non-functional testing, like performance testing as well as security testing. That's okay. Much. It's it's great. It's, it's a great background. Uh, so API testing, UI testing, uh, security testing. Uh, you are like a guru of testing. Yes, <laughs> but the security and performance, it's not uh, like uh, full length. But just I involved with uh, other team members when they are doing like a kind of coordination, I would say. Okay, so and uh, in SmartBear, within the SmartBear products, uh, do you use uh, Ready API, right? Yes, um, I, I was using uh, SOAP UI. After that, we moved move to Ready API. Okay, great. And uh, can you share with the community, because many we have many Ready API users, can you share maybe the most interesting use case or the most um, um, interesting testing challenge that you were able to accomplish by using Ready API? Maybe recently you have implemented it, or maybe last year? Um, I would say uh, first and foremost is the data-driven testing. The best benefit of uh, Ready API is data-driven testing. So when we are going with like multiple test cases, when we use some other uh, like uh, free tools, it's difficult to handle the data driven. We have to use, uh, we have to write, or we have to customize our code uh, to read the data from the Excel sheet, and we have to uh, write code to dump our reports or uh, our um, results to Excel sheet again. But if we go with Ready API, we have all inbuilt functionalities like data source, data, uh, data sync, data source loop. So automatically, we can utilize that inbuilt functions and we can uh, generate our reports and we can read the uh, data from the Excel sheet or different kind of uh, source, whichever we are using. So that's the uh, first uh, uh, benefit. And uh, we have a like, lot of benefits if I go through the list, like uh, mm, uh, reports, like customized uh, reports. Mm, in free source tools, we may get like uh, just an overview of report, but if you go with the Ready API, we, get, we can get lot of kind of uh, reports, all kinds of reports, I would say. And uh, transaction logs, we can, you can use. Um, when we are going with the data-driven testing, uh, we don't know which step failed when you click. It, it go through one by one, one by one right away, right? So mm -hmm. we may not capture the um, between a failed step. But if you go with the transaction logs in the API, it clearly shows which step it's failed. So, yep. Those are the main things I observed and I use daily basis. Okay, I see. So yeah, Ready API is a very powerful tool, and uh, he, it's um, data database or no, not database, but uh, data driven uh, feature is one of the key that uh, makes up UI open source users move to Ready API. I suppose that was a key for you as well. Yes, uh, and even the UI uh, looks more um, easy, so you can. Um, drag and drop kind of things easily and you can you know uh, even when if you have load test 
and you can use load ui pro from that uh, and you can uh, manage your test very easily yeah yeah i agree with you um so uh, you joined uh, the Smart Bay community and the Ready API community around two years ago. I saw your profile. So do you remember the day when you joined the community or maybe do, rem do you remember the, like, the reason? Why did you create a community account? What did you do first after that? To be frank, uh, I don't remember the date when I, exactly <laughs> I was joined. Mm, but uh, uh, so when I uh, started uh, working with uh, SOPI, uh, Free version, so and and new. Uh, I was working like in uh, late 2014 and uh, 2015, um, beginning of 2015. But uh, I'm uh, having like minimal uh, work on those things. I was supposed to work on SQL more at that time, uh, so uh, I didn't get chance to get involved more in the SOPI. But uh, uh, starting of uh, 2018, mid of 2018, um, I get into API automation, uh, pure uh, API automation uh, project. So from there, I started uh, getting into SOPI more. So when we get some issues or some uh, problems, uh, which we don't know, it's, I would say it's not a problem, but which we don't know. So okay. I, I started looking into uh, online, like uh, when I get solutions from Smart Bear community. So I went through that. Most of the times I, I was able to find my answers in the smart bear community other than other uh, like uh, the portals whatever so uh, i started hey uh, we can find all the all kind of answers which we are having since we are using smart bear tool so uh, i started like that looking at into all the posts all the solutions uh, in the community members uh, posted so after that i'm going i, I thought initially uh, we should be pro to answer the questions uh, uh, if you have all like 100% knowledge, then only we, we might answer all the questions which uh, uh, community members or community people are posting. But after some time, like after one, one and a half year, um, I started posting the answers as well. So uh -huh. it, it teaches it me like um, what are the, what kind of uh, issues we face. Uh, like it might be a small for someone else uh, who already faced that uh, issue, but it it is very difficult for us because we don't know what exactly is going on with it. So, uh, like that, I started my journey with uh, community, uh, smart bear community. I uh, like uh, I would say like appreciate my community members because every time they right away sometimes we get within one one and a half hour we get solution uh, for our uh, issues. Otherwise, we might uh, fight with it with that issue for uh, days and days if no one is answer. I mean, if no one is there to help us. But the community is helping us a lot uh, to solve our issue within a minimal time. The that, that's great. That's actually great, uh, like growth even inside this Smartware community, uh, because you've come just to, to find the solution. And so now you are mostly pull solutions, and uh, so we are very happy, and we are very happy that you part so, so available part of the Smartware community now, and uh, that you are ready to share your knowledge uh, with other community members, because uh, your answers now help other people. Yes. who just start uh, using the Ready API or Soap API. And um, from now, so you, you followed this great path. And uh, at the moment, what, um, what, what do you see? Which benefits uh, the Smart Bear and the Ready API community can give for new members? And what uh, new members or new Ready API users should do in order to get these benefits? Just maybe to grow faster, uh, something like this. I would say just uh, what I do uh, from last one, one and a half year, every day morning, like how we check our email, I go to Smart Bear community page. I'll check who, like what kind of uh, issues uh, people posted, like which I can answer. And uh, uh, like sometimes we don't know that issue as well. Like we think about that, oh, uh, we never face this. If we get that situation, how are we going to solve it? So I look in that way and i try to solve it i know it it might take a couple of minutes for some questions it may take uh, like some time for a couple of some questions so but uh, when we, we have which we take a, a long time uh, for those types of questions i will uh, spend uh, after my like work hours or something when i'm free so i will spend on those like i will try to code it and i will try to execute it hey i'm getting that proper uh, result or not kind of uh, 
anything in that way i will try to solve it if those are simple questions yes as i mentioned the question is very difficult to the person who is posting but it might be easy for us because we already went through that so uh, for those uh, questions it may take like two, two minutes or one minute so i can we can post answer directly so for the new users just go through each and every post we might think it's not related to us but one day it will be so uh, i would say go through that uh, answer uh, i mean to say question if someone already answered go through that solution as well so it will be helpful as well. Learn, learn, learn in advance. Yes, learn. I mean to say, just going through it. Uh, yeah, uh, I would say yes. Uh, just go uh, go through it. Uh, so some uh, some issues we might uh, have in our uh, situation, but we might forget about those. So we get solution if we are going through that uh, post from the company. Okay. That, okay. Thanks a lot. It was very interesting. Um, I learned lots about you, and uh, now I think that uh, the community will read your replies with a bigger interest. Uh, so thanks a lot for this interview, and uh, I hope to see you in the Smart Bay community. <laughs> sure. Thank you. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.